Hello and welcome to the tutorial on subtraction. In this tutorial we will learn how to subtract a three-digit number and the number one using the vertical format. Now it's very simple but it's important you learn the concepts in this tutorial because when we do larger numbers these will come in handy. Okay so let's start with our first example. 674 minus 1. 674 minus 1. Let's label the columns. We don't have to but it's a uh, it's good practice. Units, tens and hundreds. So we are now ready to go ahead and do the subtraction. And as always, we start with the column on the right-hand side first. So the units. We've got 4 minus 1. 4 minus 1 is 3. 4 minus 1 is 3. Now we'll do the tens. We've got 7 tens, but we've got 0 here. 7 minus 0 is 7. As for the hundreds, well, it's the same. We've got 6 hundreds minus 0, so 6 minus 0 is 6. And that is our answer. 674 minus 1 is 673. Now we're going to look at one which involves carrying. Suppose this time we've got 520. So 520 minus 1. Let's label the columns. Again, we've got units, tens, and hundreds. Okay, so we're ready to go ahead and do the subtraction. And as always, we start with the column on the right-hand side first. So let's do the workings at the bottom. We've got 0 minus 1. 0 minus 1. Well, that's going to be a negative number, so we cannot do that. So what we're going to do is, we're going to take a 10 from this digit over here, the 2. Now we've done this before, follow this closely. We're going to cross out the 2, here we go, and 2, the number before 2 is 1. So we're taking 1 from here and we're adding the 1 to the right. So the units has now become 10 minus 1, not 0, but 10 minus 1. Now you know this from your number bonds. 10 minus 1 is 9. Okay, so we've done the units. Now we're going to do the tens. How many tens do we have? Well, we don't have 2, but we've got 1. 1 minus 0 is 1. And lastly, we've got the hundreds. We've got 5 hundreds minus, again, it's a minus 0, so we've got 5 hundreds. So 520 minus 1 equals 519. Okay, we're going to look at one final example. This one's a bit more tricky. We've got 300. 300 minus 1. I'm sure some of you are shouting out the answer, but it's important that we work through the principles of this. Units, tens, hundreds. We've labelled the columns. We're ready to go ahead and do the subtraction. So let's start, as we always do, on the right-hand side. We've got 0 minus 1. Now again, we cannot do that. 0 minus 1. So what we're going to do is, we need to take a 10 from the digit on the left. But hold on. The digit on the left over here is also a zero. So now what do we do? Well, we have to go further to the left. We have to take a digit from the hundreds. Now, I want you to follow this very closely. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change colors for this so that we can follow this together. Okay, the three in the hundreds, I'm going to cross out the three. The number before 3 is 2. 
So we've taken one from there and we're going to add it to the tens. So we've now got 10 tens. We can now cross out the 10 over here. Okay. In fact, I'll change colors again. We'll cross out the 10. The 10 now becomes a 9. So we've taken one from there and the one goes to the right hand side. Okay. Now, if you didn't understand that or didn't follow it very clearly, play the video again. So the units has now become 10 minus 1. Okay. Not 0, but 10 minus 1. And you know this 10 minus 1 is 9. So we can write this down. 9. Now how about the tens? Well, the tens, we've got 9 tens. We don't have 0. We've got 9 tens. 9 tens minus 0 is 9. And lastly, we've got the hundreds. We've got two hundreds. Not three, but we've got two hundreds. Two minus 0 is 2. And that is our answer. 300 minus 1 equals 299. In fact, I'm just going to write it here again. 300 minus 1. Now, some of you would have shouted the answer out. If we're minusing 1, we are counting back by 1. So 300, the number before 300 is 299. That's the same as the answer we came to over here. So just follow the principles. These will come in handy when we're looking at larger numbers. So that is subtraction of a three-digit number and the number one using the vertical format.